Hi everybody, this is Marco and welcome to my channel. Today I want to speak about this. This is the Viltrox EFM2 adapter. What is this? It is an adapter for the Panasonic cameras like the G84, the G85 or the GH5S to use Canon lenses. I use it on the Panasonic GH5. This is an incredible adapter and it is now well known as the Speed Booster Metabones Killer because it is a substitute of the Metabones for, let's say, four times the price. I purchased it on Amazon for about 200 euros, while the Metabones is about 800 euros in Italy. So that is four times the price difference. It worth the difference? Well, it is very cheap for sure, but it does what it promises to do. It reduces the aperture. I'm using it on the Canon 50mm 1.4, this one, which becomes 1.0. So it becomes very, very bright lens. And especially on cameras like the GH5, it is very important to have very bright lenses because we all know that GH5 is not so good in low light situation. I'm using also on the Canon 24 to 105 f4, which becomes 2.8 aperture, and it provides good results as well. The lens is very good; it is very sharp. I had one little problem that I found out is very common, and I found out a video on the YouTube. I will link it in the description. Thanks to the person that. Uh, Put this video to fix the, the problem of the infinity focus. In other words, when you try to put focus something very far away, it cannot reach the focus. And I had this problem when I received the uh, adapter. Well, it's very, very easy to fix. And as this person suggested, you have just to open the adapter and just rotate the glass inside on the right, just one or two times, then you connect it to the camera and try to see if it is in focus. I really just did two quick turn on the right and now it works very, very nice. I can feel to suggest you to buy this adapter because for less than 200 euros, you have something that can allow you to use your camera lenses and more important, it can also reduce the aperture and give you more brightness uh, for your videos. Is the autofocus working? I tried the autofocus on both on the 50 mm and on the 24 to 105, and it works decently good on both of them. Not always get the focus, especially um, on this lens, on the 50 mm, but you can still count on it. Personally, for the videos, I do not use the autofocus, so to me it's not a problem at all because I will manually focus. But if you need sometimes, especially for photos, to use the autofocus, well, you can do that. My suggestion is to buy one of these. Just remember that it will take a lot of time to receive it. In my case it took three months, but I finally got it and I'm pretty satisfied with this lens. My suggestion is uh, order now before it comes much more expensive. This is all. I will put also a video with a little test that I made with the Viltrox and the Panasonic GH5. If you like this video, please put a thumb up and subscribe to my channel to see more videos like this. Thank you for watching, grazie mille and see you next time. Ciao!